Greetings, this is Gigi Faison, and what I like to share with you today is what I got for Christmas. No, I did not get this hat for Christmas. It's just a bad hair day. But nevertheless, I wanted to jump on just to share with you some of the things that I've gotten for Christmas. Now, my request was nothing for me for Christmas. Hubby and I, we didn't buy each other anything for Christmas. I had a birthday. It was December 22nd. I had a gathering at the home, um, and I requested all my family and friends to bring me a toy for, for my birthday. And what I did was, um, on my actual birthday, which was the 22nd, um, I had the gathering on the 21st, which was on Saturday. Birthday was on Sunday. So I had all my friends and families to bring me a toy. And what we did on my actual birthday is we went and we um, helped out in a toy drive. So all the toys that I got for my birthday, I actually donated those to the um, toy drive. And the toy drive is something that my new son-in-law participates in. Um, I think he's done it for the last two to three years. So I thought it was very good, um, a very good gesture to, you know, to help others. And my hubby and I and um, the kids and the grandkids, um, I think three, three of the grandkids um, went out and we helped serve food, drinks, um, the young, my nephew, my, my grandsons, they, um, were some very helpful young men. They helped to carry the plates to the tables and assisted with drinks and assisted moms with kids um, with their plates. So it went over very well. So after that, um, you know, then of course Christmas was, we had our Christmas gathering. We do Christmas Eve here at the house. Um, because all the girls are married now, they have family, so, you know, we always get Christmas Eve, we don't get to see them on Christmas Day, we do get to speak to them, but, you know, they, they have other um, moms and, and mom-in-laws and mom-in-loves and, you know, to, to go out and visit, so um, I, I jumped on to share with you what I got for Christmas, but I did want to share with you what was actually done um, on my birthday. Uh, one of the items that I got for Christmas, everybody that know me knows that I love bling. So this note uh, book came from uh, a very good sister, a uh, friend uh, from church. Um, just a very good person. I, I love her a lot. Um, she got me this. And my hubby and I, we were talking about trying to find something to do our um, budget for the year. And so when I saw this, I was like, oh my God, this will be perfect. Um, if you'll check that out. And then it's, it's almost like a book. And you can go in and write um, whatever you choose to in here. Very, very sturdy. Very, very pretty. I love it a lot. She knows I love bling. Also, she got me... Um, this little mirror case here. Now let me tell you about this mirror case. My younger daughter had bought for my other two girls one of these um, probably about two, maybe three years ago. And I wanted one of those things and I just looked and looked and I didn't know where to go looking for them. Uh, but I've just kind of been looking when I'm out or when I think about it to try to find me one of those little glammed out um, one of these little glammed out pieces here is the mirror. Um, more like a lipstick mirror. You can look in and put your lipstick on. However, um, so the same girlfriend that gave me the bling also gave me this. So I was like, oh my God, she knows me so well. Knows exactly what I want. Also, she gave me this calendar. And this calendar was so thoughtful. What she had, she went through, and it's another one of our um, girlfriends. It's three of us. We generally take pictures at, after church on Sundays or when, whenever we're out and about. 
we are photogenic and ready. Um, so what she did, she had us a desk calendar made and she went through and just inserted several of our pictures that we had taken throughout the year. So I thought this was very, very thoughtful and very, very sweet. I love this thing a lot. Also, um, my other girlfriend, she knows that my hubby and I, we like to snuggle up. So she got each of us a matching throw blanket that we can snuggle and uh, nestle under um, at night. Also, um, one of our, our middle daughter, she had this made for me. And I don't know if you can see that it has um, Gigi. And then it has all of the, let's see if I can get it straight. It has Gigi here in the heart. And then it has the grandkids' names on the blanket. And this is beautiful. I love it. Uh, it is just, just me. Now, there is a discrepancy with the color. Somehow, some way, my husband, younger daughter, got the message that my favorite color was purple. My favorite color is pink. I like purple, but my favorite color is pink. So she got that information, and we actually had that discussion during a game that we played um, during my little birthday get together. And I asked, you know, I was asking some questions about how well do you know me? And so they all said purple. And only one of my girlfriends um, got it right. She said pink. Um, but I don't know where they got the purple thing from. Maybe one time I painted my room purple. And maybe that's where they got it from. I did say at one time that back in the day, I used to mix the pink and the purple together and wear those types of outfits. But my favorite color is pink. So, now, uh, my baby girl and her husband got me this essential um, vlogging kit. I haven't put it together yet or, or actually got into it, but it's coming. I'm going to work with it and see if I can work it out. Um, but it has like the little stand. It has like the stand and the microphone and... Um, the, the light lighting and all of that so I will be working with that and hopefully it will come in handy with me in operating my channel and they also got me um, from Sephora um, it's a sample set of um, perfumes and what I do is I am supposed to sample the perfumes and see which one I like and then I go in inside there's a um, gift card or gift certificate inside from Sephora um, this is what the samples look like there's like a whole row of samples here of different fragrances and then I will take this voucher here into the store and get a full-size bottle so this was a very thoughtful and a very neat um, and it gives a card and, and, and information about the fragrance so I thought this was very very lovely <clears throat> also I got from the same daughter that gave me the blanket with the um, with the initials and the grandkids names she also gave me um, a necklace that has the three daughters initials um, on the necklace here and that is very beautiful. I think I'll leave that out and wear that tomorrow. And then our oldest daughter, what she did was, which was awesome, she wrote us a, you know, words, you can't replace words with nothing else. I mean, words are just everything. Um, she wrote us a note, and what she and her husband has done is they have scheduled us or given us a voucher for a photo shoot that we can take at any time, anywhere. So what we do is we contact the person that um, is going to do the photo shoot and we tell them she, she will either come to the home or she will come anywhere that we choose to have the, the setting done. So that was very, very, a very nice gift. Um, and you can't, like I said, you can't replace words with no type of gift. 
um, because the words come from the heart. And I love all the gifts that my daughters um, put thought into. And, you know, they thought about me and, and the things that I need in my life. And the gifts was great. And so were the gifts from my girlfriends. They know me so well. I'm missing a gift that one of my other girlfriend gave me. And this was a nice gesture from one of the elders at church. It's a little lipstick holder um, that she gave um, us. And I thought it was very cute. Um, I like it a lot. So that is what I got for Christmas. Um, I'm just grateful to have life and to have family. To be able to come together and love on one another. Also, let me share with you what I'm wearing today. Today is a bad hair day, so this is why we have the hat on today. You want to look at the hat here. Now, I want you to also check out how I turned my little simple uh, turtleneck and jeans into a fabulous and fly outfit. Fabulous, fabulous at 50. Um, we're going to keep that going. Fabulous at 50. Now, what I did was I put on my... Um, a throw here and if you can check it out and what I did was I embellished it with a little pin here and then if you want to check out my footwear these are some boots let me see if I can actually step out of one of these these boots I've had them for they were a gift from a girlfriend one of my girlfriends, we've been friends since ninth grade. She gave me these boots about five, five to ten years ago. Um, I've worn them maybe once or twice. As you can see, the fur around here. The texture in the back here. And it's a suede boot, so you know you have to be, you know, have to have the weather right and uh, no rain and that kind of thing when you wear your suede boots. But this is how I took my little simple turtleneck and blue jean outfit and made it into something that was very fashionable and fabulous fashionable and fabulous at 50 is such an awesome thing so let me let you check me out here now you see me here and you see my hat. Again, this is Gigi Faison. I thank you for checking in. Have a blessed day. And I thank you if you like what you see and want to see more of my Fabulous and 50 dressing and decor. Give me a thumbs up. Subscribe to my channel. Leave me a comment. And I will get you what you request. Thank you so much for checking in. Gigi Faison. Goodbye now.